in this video we are going to study leveling in two parts first part is parts of leveling instrument and second one is temporary adjustments of leveling instrument or setting the leveling instruments on the field the leveling instruments has different parts and these parts are like look at here this is the eyepiece this is the object focus screw and this is object glass means you see through here you use this screw and you see the object that is leveling stuff but you don't only see that you take actually measurements like a scale through the telescope that we will see later on now once it is over this is a part of the telescope then if you come down here it is a dry branch where upper part of the foot screws upper part of the foot screws is called as tri brush and lower part is called as trivet remember this is also used this term is also used in case of theodolite so tri brush is upper part of the three foot screws where the three foot screws are connected and the lower part is called as trivet now we have got a trivet at below and tri brush above in between them naturally there are foot screws so foot screws connect trivet and trivet to each other then here it is a leveling head or the combination is called as leveling head if we have seen important thing we store here that is coarse sight when you cannot see the staff through the telescope clearly first it is expected that you should see through the top grooves here there is groove which cannot see that and the upper that is called as rifle sights also so you can see through this and then later on we can keep our eye here and see the staff now let us go to the temporary adjustments temporary please remember temporary is not a big thing it is only setting the instrument on the field nothing else so that is a tripod stand is placed over here as a first stage so this is a part of a temporary adjustment tripod stand is placed over here and now we are going to slowly install the instrument and start taking the reading so that step we are going to see now now leveling instrument is placed over here on top of that fixed with the help of one screw which is at the bottom of the tripod stand it actually is here and it is connected and it is rotated so after rotating it gets fixed with this so here one important thing that you have to ensure that this is horizontal as possible by adjusting the legs in such a manner that the top of that particular tripod stand is horizontal so that our further task of leveling the instrument properly is reduced considerably look at this figure now here these three foot screws are here you can see now now these three foot screws are like this 1 2 and 3 now what we do is we choose we choose any two foot screw and a single foot screw now in this case the combination of these two foot screws is chosen and one comp foot screw separately chosen means we turn both the foot screws inside and adjust the level or level t over here so that the moment you start turning inside either the bubble will go here or in this direction and we have to ensure that the bubble remains at the center if it is by turning in this direction if it is going in this direction away from the center then you unwind it and move in the opposite direction so that the bubble again starts coming to the center that is what it is once it is over now you turn the telescope 90 degrees and then you only rotate one screw same step if you are rotating in this direction and it is at the center it is going away you can return or you can turn it in the opposite direction so remember opposite direction is used when it is going away from the center this is also a bubble tube and this bubble tube is having one bubble at the center and there is a flat glasses here and engraved with a small circle inside black circle by adjusting the foot screws you have to bring it in the back now it is a clear understanding that whenever we are using linear tube yes straight bubble tube then we cannot understand the movement of the bubble in the perpendicular direction 
Now in this case, this possibility is there. So we have got one freedom that we can independently operate any of the screw and manage to get that bubble at the center. Once we try to get the bubble at the center, another level placed on the level leveling instrument anywhere that actually is useful later on for further fine leveling and automatically when it is at the center you get everything proper just small adjustment is required using this tube sometimes this tube may not also be there in some of the leveling instruments because auto level mechanism is already there now once we have leveled the instrument using any of the method which we discuss now we see through the eyepiece and turn the eyepiece in such a manner that we see the crosshairs very clearly please remember we have to first ensure that we are seeing this crosshair properly now see here this should be seen very clearly like this and they should never be blurred now it this particular setting is associated with our spectacle number because somebody may have different number somebody may have some other number so this can be adjusted by using this remember always whenever you are using any optical instrument you should first adjust this so that the crosshair is clear once the crosshair is very clear then you can start other reading always remember otherwise you will get wrong readings so sometimes they may become transparent sometimes they may vanish by adjusting this you can adjust individual is having different number for his spectacle so whenever somebody else is changing taking observation then again he should adjust this once again please remember don't forget this second stage is now we use this object glass focusing and then we start seeing through this or through this telescope to the staff and then we start taking the reading so this is what all temporary adjustment means means simply taking the level instrument to the field setting it on tripod and then adjusting it in a horizontal manner and adjust the eyepiece as well as object glass so that you can start taking the reading once it is over now your leveling instrument is set over here now you can start taking the observations here the crosshairs are very clear as well as your staff observation or staff image is very clear and you can directly start taking the observations this way we have adjusted the level on the ground and now started taking the reading and this is called as temporary adjustment of leveling instrument don't get unnecessarily bogged down because of the name it is only setting your level on the ground thank you and next time we will see some other important aspects of leveling